Hi, this is Dr. Nandini Nalivigi, Director Nalivigi Dental Clinic, a multi-speciality dental center at Bellendor, Bangalore. Root canal treatment involves the removal of the pulp from the crown as well as from the root. So whenever we are removing the pulp, we have to use chelating agents which will help us remove the pulp entirely and also use a lot of irrigants which will help us remove the pulp debris or the infected pulp from the pulp chamber as well as the pulp canals. Now whenever we are doing this, sometimes a little portion, a very small portion of the irrigant or the chelating agent may escape into the bone and here they cause some kind of an inflammatory response. That is why all endodontists usually prescribe some kind of an analgesic to be taken which will lower down these inflammatory changes in the root. Sometimes even an antibiotic may be prescribed if you have an infected pulp. Now whenever these irrigants or the chelating agents escape into the bone and an inflammatory response is formed, you can have some kind of pain and the pain is experienced especially in the buccal sulcus or the buccal or the lingual area and that is how the patient experiences pain during root canal treatment and if you take these analgesics and antibiotics for a period of 3 to 5 days you should feel good and be totally asymptomatic.